Okay guys, it's me Kate again. So this video is my Enchanto book tag. Based on songs uh, from Disney's uh, uh, movie Enchanto. So, the first question is book, uh, name a book that explores multiple, multiple family generations. A Dairy for Vampire by Abigail Gibbs, a were following Violet Lee, who one day while waiting for her family her witnesses a massacre of about 30 men, uh, 26 guys who uh, end up being vampires, one of them being a vampire heir to the throne and one of the others being his younger brother, and they take, uh, take her with them, and it's actually... Uh, uh, during, during the book we are both exploring the uh, vampire law family along with uh, Violet's own family actually. Then I have what is a book you enjoy that took life longer than expected to finish. Turn of class by Sarah J. Mast and we are fall in which we are following an assassin named Selena Sardotian who prior to the events of the first book was uh, captured and is working as a slave in salt mines up until the day when the uh, uh, captain of the king's guard comes and takes her to the crown prince who asks her to be his champion in, uh, uh, the, in the fight to become king's assassin in exchange for her freedom. It literally took me a month. And I have a name a character who has to do it all, Selena. Sardozin from Throne of Glass, then he can talk about the book you haven't talked about. And I talked about all my books, I think. And you can name a book that you thought would be a light and fluffy, but to uh, hit emotionally. Uh, which was by Lisa Case, in which you are following Sebastian, who is a kid, which is Japanese nine tail fox spirit with elemental magic. And he has been on the run ever since something happened to him a year ago. Up until now, when uh, he bumps into an alpha werewolf named Liam, who actually saved him a year ago. Then we have ca uh, characters who make you believe in Swamit, Sebastian and Liam from Witch Blood. Then we have a name book that features a re a rebuilding relationships. I don't really know. Probably second book in Vampire Academy, Very Hill Mead, but I don't remember really. That one, and the last question is the name of a book that left you in, in, immersed in the culture, which by Balisa is it, uh, along with a few others. Her books tend to have a lot of different uh, cultures in them. Kids uh, Tura Chronicles has Japanese culture and stuff like that. So this is it for this video. If you like, please like, share, and subscribe. Down below on my social media, my email, and some other stuff. And I'll see you next time.